Fatiha. Since the restricted movement order or RMO begin, my life is full of boxes. This is because people are not allowed shopping freely in shopping complex, grocery stores, and markets. So, instead of buying goods outside, my mom indulged herself in shopping online and became an e-shopaholic. What a nightmare! Boxes and boxes arrive endlessly at my house and increases drastically day by day. Uh, I can't stand it anymore! Hmm, what should I do with these boxes? Hmm? I know what to do. Let's make a candy dispenser. I need a box, a hot glue gun, an empty jar, and a button. Sorry, mom. A soldering iron, a ruler, a cutting knife. Eh, mana butang besar tadi? These are the measurements that we need to make the candy dispenser. First, glue the three components. By the way, be careful with the hot glue gun. Secondly, attach other components like I'm doing in this video. And then cut the skewer to make it short. Disclaimer, be careful when you cut the skewer because my finger end up like this. Then glue a button at the end of the skewer. Next step, use the soldering iron to make a hole in the jar slit. And lastly, fill the jar with the candies. And voila, the candy dispenser is done. It is cute, right? This candy dispenser can prevent tiny candies from spilling all over the place. It also looks very nice. So, this is what we call trash to treasure. And don't worry, the other boxes have been sent to the recycling center by my father. Recycling it will produce some money instead of throwing it as a rubbish. That's all from this video. Bye guys!